ICE AGENTS SWEEP 7-ELEVEN STORES BEFORE DAWN TODAY, CRACKING DOWN ON ILLEGAL WORKERS AND PUTTING EMPLOYERS ON NOTICE. I DON'T NECESSARILY AGREE WITH THAT. NEARLY 100 STORES WERE TARGETED COAST TO COAST WITH A STRONG MESSAGE FROM IMMIGRATION OFFICIALS TO U.S. BUSINESSES THAT HIRING AN ILLEGAL WORKFORCE IS AGAINST THE LAW. THE RAIDS INVOLVE 7-ELEVEN STORES ACROSS NORTHERN CALIFORNIA, INCLUDING SANTA CLARA, NAPA, PETALUMA, SANTA ROSA, NORTH SEBASTOPOL AND SASSOON CITY. And NEW AT 6, CBS 13'S KELLY RYAN SPOKE WITH EMPLOYEES AT THE SASSOON CITY LOCATION AND HAS MORE ON THEIR UNUSUAL MORNING. Special agents showed up at this 7 Eleven early this morning on Sunset Avenue. It was a surprise visit for the owner and to customers. A clerk inside telling me the agents had a very specific request. Special agents served notices of inspection on this 7 Eleven in Sassoon City Wednesday morning. It was one of 98 7 Eleven stores nationwide targeted by Immigration and Customs Enforcement. Store employees at the Sunset Avenue location say agents asked for identification and some paperwork and left a short time later. The store did not close down. You can see in this store surveillance video agents working as part of the sweep at a Santa Rosa 7 Eleven. Other Northern California locations that were part of today's probe included Santa Clara, Petaluma, North Sebastopol, and Napa. Agents arrested 21 people suspected of being in the country illegally during the entire sweep. The action was targeted at management. In a statement, ICE Deputy Director Thomas Homan called today's actions a strong message to U.S. employers hiring illegal workers, saying in a statement, businesses that hire illegal workers are a pull factor for illegal immigration, and we are working hard to remove this magnet. ICE will continue its efforts to protect jobs for American workers by eliminating unfair competitive advantages for companies that exploit illegal immigration. Today's actions come out of a four-year-old case against a franchisee in Long Island. The investigation in that case could lead to criminal charges or fines over the store's hiring practices. 7-Eleven stores are based in Irving, Texas, with more than 8,600 stores in the United States. At the Sassoon City store, this regular customer says he didn't see the agents interviewing store owners and managers this morning, but thinks the raid is unfair. I don't necessarily agree with that because, like, if you're not harming the community, I don't feel like anyone should be bothering you. ICE officials saying if store owners aren't complying, it will take aggressive steps to hold them accountable. Kelly, thanks.